to the channel fragrance journey hopefully everybody's having a blessed day hopefully everybody's having a blessed weekend i was tagged by my friend sending moments to do the one fragrance to rule them all tag video shout out to him he got a great channel i'm gonna link his channel down in the description box I always got great reviews I always reviewing exclusive juice so that's a channel I, you, you should definitely be subscribed to so going through my collection, I've been collecting for like 11 months now. I'm up to like 145, 150 bottles. Uh, of that, 130 are niche uh, offerings. But lately, I've been only into darker leathers and things of that nature. So it's kind of hard to find a fragrance that was unisex, that could be worn in multiple seasons. I don't know about the compliment part. I think somebody added that in there. But... Also, one that's gonna get you some compliments, also, and it was tough for me. It was tough for me, but the scent I decided to go with was one um, that I really enjoyed. One that I didn't think I would like, but I got this earlier on uh, when I first started getting into niche fragrances, and that fragrance is Incident Diplomatique by Javor, and. First, when I was smelling this, I thought to myself, well, man, you probably can't wear this in the wintertime. But this is definitely a beefy type fragrance. It's got great projection, great longevity. It's going to push in the cold. It's going to push in the fall. Um, I've worn it in the colder weather, and it pushed. It, it really shocked me. I'm not even sure. I think when I did my review, I might have said this was a warmer season type fragrance. But this is definitely can be worn year-round in my eyes. Um, it starts off with a beautiful mandarin. You get to some Haitian vetiver, it's got Java vetiver, it's got some spicy nutmeg, it's got a really beautiful earthy patchouli, and it's got some sandalwood. It's put together really, really well. I'm not really into vetiver, but this vetiver is beefy, strong. Um, it's just a really nice, nice, nice vetiver. It's got two kind of vetivers, and it's also got a beautiful earthy green patchouli. I mean, you really can't go wrong with it. And um, in my collection, it was hard for me to pick one, but that would be the one to rule them all at the moment. Um, if, if you just said just pick one fragrance, it don't matter what season or whatever, just pick one fragrance, then it may not be there. But if I had to pick one that can, can be worn by a woman or a man and fit in multiple seasons, uh, Incident Diplomatique would probably be my choice. And I guess I need to tag some people. I want to tag my guy. Dan from Center Waters. Knowing him, he's crazy. He's probably already been tagged like 17 times, but that's my guy. It's like family. Um, I always talk to him, rap with him and stuff. Really cool guy. I'm going to leave the link to his channel down in the description box. Uh, and Also, I want to tag my guy Fragrance Ninja. People sleeping on this cat, man. Got a great channel. Reviews great fragrances. Uh, another brother that I support. Um, I always watch his videos. Definitely, definitely a dope channel and one that you need to be subscribed to. But if you can't like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you know when I drop my next video. And tell me if you smell Incident Diplomatique from the House of Javoy. If you think it can be worn by a man or a woman, do you think this can be worn in the cold weather? Uh, and if you don't have it, definitely get a sample of this because this is really, really, really good juice. Um, so, other than that, I hope... If you woke up today, you're definitely winning. And other than that, I'm out. Peace.